The DPP has finally settled on a legislative speaker candidate after DPP caucus convener Ke Jianming, who had previously insisted he would never withdraw from the race, unexpectedly dropped his bid today, along with Chen Mingwen, another contender. Both have given their support to Su Jiaquan, a close ally of President-elect Tsai Ing-wen. The motion for Su and legislator Tsai Chi Chang to be the party's pick for legislative speaker and deputy speaker was passed with a show of hands by the DPP's legislative caucus. This morning at 8 a.m., the three of us worked this out ourselves. I will support Su Jia Chen as our legislative speaker. The DPP's legislative caucus showed their approval for Su and Tsai as legislative speaker and deputy legislative speaker by clapping their hands. A day earlier, Kaohsiung Mayor Chen Zhu attempted to mediate, but at the time, Kerr would not budge. However, today he suddenly had a change of heart. When asked if he had been put under pressure to withdraw from President-elect Tsai Ing-wen, Ke brushed reporters aside and ended his interview. Tsai then personally clarified that she had never put pressure on Ke to withdraw. I never urged him to withdraw his bid. There were several prospective candidates for legislative speaker. They were able to coordinate by themselves. I just reminded our legislative caucus that after the election, society is hoping for a new legislature, a new form of politics. Although she stressed that the party's choice of Sue was a result of coordination among the candidates, Tsai did not forget to stress the new political atmosphere. It was hard for people not to think these remarks were aimed at Ke, an old guard eight-term lawmaker.